Hello everyone, this is Vikram and welcome to my channel. Uh, in this video, we are going to talk about how to install Terraform on Windows, Linux and Mac operating systems. So we'll refer the official Terraform documentation for this. So I'm in the official Terraform website. In order to download Terraform, you need to click on this download link or else you can uh, go to the install uh, options under the documentation section as well. So let's click on this download link. So for Mac OS, uh, you know, this is the uh, actual uh, command. So you need to run these two commands. In case if you, uh, you know, if Homebrew is not installed in Mac o operating system, you can install Homebrew. So you can basically install Homebrew by uh, running this command. So once Homebrew is installed, you know, you can basically execute these two commands, then automatically Terraform will be uh, installed. Now coming to the windows, uh, so I can download uh, of, uh, AMD 64 architecture by clicking on this download button. So let's click on this download button and uh, uh, download this version of Terraform. So once it is downloaded, you need to extract it. And uh, this is the Terraform executable. So this is basically the uh, application. If you try to install it by double clicking on it, it won't work as expected. Uh, so uh, how to access this exe file is either you open the terminal in exactly uh, this location, like by selecting, uh, by opening command prompt in uh, uh, this download folder, and then you can uh, run terraform.exe and it should respond. But if you try to access this uh, Terraform binary from um, other locations, let's say I'm opening command prompt um, in a different location. And if I try to run this Terraform command, it won't uh, detect because basically terraform.exe is not in the system path. So what uh, we need to do uh, first is either we add this new path to the environment variables uh, or else uh, what I will do is I'll just cut this terraform.exe file, which I just extracted. And then I'll move into a location. Uh, so here in inside this C drive, I created this tools folder and uh, I'll move this terraform.exe, um, you know, into this tools folder. You can name it um, with any name um, uh, since I'll be, uh, you know, storing all my binaries like EKSCTL, kubectl, um, you know, uh, so these are all the CLI tools. So I named this folder as tool. So you can use any name. Then what we will do is, uh, so we will open environment variables. So let's search for uh, environment variables and then click on this edit the system environment variables. Now, once the uh, pop-up opens, so just click on the environment variables option here. So there are two variables, um, you know, uh, there are user related variables and there are system variables. So if you want to use Terraform only um, inside your own user account, you can modify user variables. Otherwise, you can uh, directly modify the system variable. So for the system variables, you need to uh, click on this path. Just double click on it. So it will open the uh, edit panel. So let me try to open it again. So here, uh, edit the environment variable. So what we need to do is, if you see, I already added the C drive tools folder. So let me delete it and show you how to add it. So you need to click on new and add the path where your terraform.exe file is there. So just, uh, you know, select the whole text C drive tools and then click on new and then add this path Then click on. Okay. Okay. And okay. So now uh, your tools uh, folder is added to the path. Now what you can do is you can uh, open a new command prompt. So if you have any existing command prompt, just close it and reopen it. Now, if you try to uh, run Terraform, it should respond. So it should respond from any location. So this is how you install Terraform and configure the system path environment variable. So if you want to know the Terraform version, so you can run Terraform uh, space version. So we are running Terraform uh, 1.5.6 on Windows AMD 64. Now, if you want to uh, install Terraform on uh, Linux operating system, um, you know, you can choose your uh, uh, package manager, like for Ubuntu, uh, CentOS, Fedora, AMI, Linux, that is Amazon Linux, and this is for Homebrew. Uh, so for Amazon Linux, we are going to uh, use these commands. So I, I already have one EC2 instance up and running. So if you don't know how to create an EC2 instance and how to access the, um, how to SSH into the EC2 instance. So uh, just wait for uh, 
a couple of videos like we are going to create a separate video on how to create an ec2 instance but if you already know how to create an ec2 instance you can create and run and then run these commands so i ssist uh, into uh, one of the ec2 instance and i am running sudo su to become root then what i'll do is i'll um, execute all these three commands so first thing is i'm i'll be installing some yum utilities And then the next command is to add a new repo to download the uh, HashiCorp Terraform. So this is uh, here we are adding HashiCorp repo. So we have added it and then we need to run yum install uh, Terraform to install Terraform. So this is as simple as um, running a single command. Uh, automatically since you are using yum, uh, Terraform binary will be moved into the path variable. So you can directly run Terraform and then version. So it should actually respond. So Terraform version 1.5.6 on Linux AMD 64. So since we don't have Mac machine for now, you know, if you have Mac, you can basically install Homebrew if it is not installed and then run these two commands. Automatically Terraform will be installed. So that's it for this video. In the next video, we'll talk about how to install VS Code on Windows and then uh, we will understand how to install Terraform, uh, you know, plugin in the VS Code. Thank you.